Concrobium Mold Control is a revolutionary solution that cleans, eliminates, and prevents mold and mildew with no harmful chemicals. For larger mold and mildew cleanup and prevention jobs, a cold fogging machine or fogger is an effective, easy way to apply Concrobium Mold Control. The fogger works by atomizing Concrobium Mold Control into fine droplets, so the solution can be misted into large or inaccessible spaces, such as musty basements, cellars, moldy attics, and crawl spaces, inside wall cavities, even RVs and automobiles. It's also an effective way to pre-treat new construction. One gallon of Concrobium Mold Control will cover approximately 2,800 square feet of total surface area. To determine your surface area in square footage, use the room dimensions to calculate the surface area of the floor, walls, and ceiling. Then divide the total square footage by 2,800. This is how many gallons of product you will require. For every 1,400 square feet of surface coverage, plan to fog for approximately 10 minutes. Concrobium mold control is appropriate for use on virtually any hard or fabric surface, but it's best to start by removing or covering room contents that may be damaged if they become wet, such as home electronics, art, or paper products. Walls, ceilings, flooring, carpets, and furniture are typically suitable for treatment with concrobium. However, as with any cleaning solution, we always recommend testing on an inconspicuous area first. Doors, windows, and vents in the target area should be closed. If your target area is mold infested, consider the use of a HEPA filter mask, goggles, and gloves to protect against mold spore inhalation. Position the fogger on a flat surface that is three to four feet off the ground in the middle of the target area. Ensure the air intake filter is in place. Filters are reusable and should be returned with your fogger to the rental retailer. Remove the fogger power head from the tank by unfastening the side clamps. Then add the required amount of concrobium mold control and re-secure the power head. Adjust the flow rate knob to medium Aim the nozzle towards the one top corner of the room at the joint line between the ceiling and the wall. When using the fogger, the objective is to saturate the air with concrobium mold control so that the mist spreads throughout the enclosed area and coats surfaces with a thin, even layer. Never use the fogger to directly spray surfaces from a short distance. This may lead to over-application. To fog your enclosed area, plug the fogger into a grounded power outlet or extension cord and activate the fogger by turning the power to on. Then leave the room. Fog concrobium mold control into the first target corner for one quarter of the total fogging time. Avoid overexposure to the fogging mist and humidity by leaving the room and re-enter once the required time has elapsed. Inspect surfaces for runoff or pooling, which are signs of over-application. If these appear, back the fogger away from the surface and reduce fogging interval times. Next, Rotate the fogger so that it points to the next corner, and again, fog in that direction for 2.5 minutes. Repeat this procedure until all four corners have been fogged and a mist has formed in the room. When fogging is complete, turn the unit off at the on-off switch. Prior to leaving the room, look for areas with excess pooling of the mist that occurred and wipe with a concrobium mold control dampened cloth or sponge for an even application. Allow the fog to dissipate for approximately 15 to 20 minutes. Once the fog has dissipated, open any windows, doors, and vents to promote drying and encourage air exchange. Finally, allow the treated space to dry overnight. If over-application has occurred, a harmless white residue might develop. Simply wipe it away with a concrobium mold control dampened cloth or sponge. Treat any remaining mold residue by wiping with another concrobium dampened cloth. For tough mold stains, paint the surface or take other cosmetic steps, such as Concrobium Mold Stain Eraser, as required. Reapply another layer of Concrobium Mold Control if a cosmetic cleaner is used once the surface has dried.